Even the normies are starting to realize that the moon is not going in front of the sun to cause the eclipse, which means there is most likely a black sun or some other type of object in the sky that is not self-illuminated like the sun and the moon within the firmament. And all of the stars up in the firmament are also self-illuminating. But if there is a black sun traveling across the sky that is imperceptible by the human eye, that is what is going in front of the sun. So all these people that are having the veil lifted and starting to question the very nature of this reality, I wonder how far down the rabbit hole they're going to go now. Are they going to start asking questions about the moon landing? Are they going to start asking questions about giant skeletons and questioning the story of dinosaurs? Are they going to start asking questions about architectural masterpieces from the Tartarian Empire that we cannot duplicate with all of our modern engineering marvels and all of this technology that we have? Are they going to start asking questions about the orphan trains? Are they going to start asking questions about why some of these buildings had 10 foot foundations with doors and windows that somehow were covered in mud? Meaning that at some point in history, there was a giant flood, a mud flood that covered up a lot of our history. The rabbit hole goes deep. And as my personal opinion, and for entertainment purposes only, that everything that we've been taught since kindergarten is a lie. And the whole plan, the whole nefarious plan of this operation is to control the mind and to separate people with divisiveness and the illusion of choice through the left-right paradigm that is really designed to divide people, to divide and conquer. Because at the end of the day, human beings are good and honest and moral, and they deserve the truth and are seeking the truth. So all of these channels, all of these brave souls on TikTok that are questioning the narrative and making you think before you hide behind your computer screen and type something nasty in the comment section because of your own fear of the unknown, Take a minute and just do some investigating and question everything you think you know, because nobody has the answers, but there's plenty of really smart people out there asking questions that not a lot of people are willing to ask because the time has come for the veil to be lifted and the truth is going to be shown. Two quick things. They wanted us to either wear our glasses so we couldn't see or to not go outside. So they push this propaganda on spraying with airplanes and all sorts of aerosols. And isn't that just genius of them? Because they know if we see either no moon crossing the sun, blocking out the sun, or a moon somewhere else in the sky, then we'll know something's fishy. And then the smarter people will know that we live on a flat earth like the guy in the last video I posted. Isn't that incredible? Incredible. That's why they want TikTok shut down, obviously. Because people are waking up. Waking up to the truth, baby. That's why the solar eclipse is so significant in the naysayers that say, nothing happened on a solar eclipse. Nothing happened at all. Nothing happened yet. But when this spreads... Because people are like, wait a minute, that makes no sense. Maybe a flat earth is the only thing that actually makes sense. Oh, 2024 is going to be exciting. I love you all. Love you all. Share this video too, because I get super suppressed myself. This is for your entertainment.